Hello everyone. Well, this time I'm selling a pretty large linear actuator um, which included one inch steel road. But uh, let me tell you the overall length. I, the overall length of this thing is 40 and a half inches just the road I don't I don't count the uh, the mounting holes just the road itself is 40 and a half inches long it's a very long piece um, this is uh, mounting what you see here there's the mounting for the table and it has a two uh, Thompson Super 16 uh, steel ball recirculating bushings in, in there inside to this um, housing, which is this uh, made of uh, anodized aluminum, is um, 178 by two and an eight by a little bit over two and a three eighths I include the mountain screws if you want to use them and it's still this is the other one on the right in the center he's got a mounting perhaps for the plate let me tell you, I have two pieces exactly the same. So, if somebody's interested in both, let me know. Um, there is one inch in diameter of the steel. And you know, <clears throat> this one doesn't show in here in any of the edges because they probably. Um, they probably remove it or something, but the other one is a Thompson rod also. This one, I see the two end and doesn't show, so I can guarantee the rod is Thompson. But, you know, they maybe uh, work a little bit on the edge or something, but anyway. Um, they have a, what I said in the right or the center, this uh, aluminum piece. To perhaps if you have the two put a table on it I mean I mean use for the screw a uh, little screw or for timing bell with pulleys whatever it's very long I just try to tell you let me pull it a little bit forward and then you probably see it's extremely heavy is 12 pounds of weight just itself and I, what I say I have two pieces this is could be great for start building a gantry for large machine pieces and the CNC um, I have pictures of the uh, of the mm, uh, of the bushing so I will show you I want to include a picture of the bushing which is inside uh, because I have one extra separate from these ones and it's exactly the same because I I removed the little um, the, the seal that I have in there to make sure is there are Thompson Thompson recirculate seal ball recirculating bushings so this a 40 and a half inches long one inch thick in really good condition of steel rod with and both ends they have a mounting ends and both ends tied it with a hex on the side so I have to sell this for you know they're gonna cost twenty dollars for shipping I just because it's twelve pounds unpacked so when I package it's going to be probably close to the 13 pounds so unfortunately 
I need to make the proper box for this piece and then I have to charge $20, $20 for shipping and I want to sell the whole thing for $69.99 um, they are more very nice absolute no play or you know you see they are very nice and tight they run, let me turn it over and check the other one <clears throat> nothing you see the um, beyond this seal there is a Super Thompson 16 bushing so they got us they got a rubber stops and here what you, you see them those rubber stops when these go all the way to the end it's my, you know hidden there actually I can show you on the other end I sure I can show you on the other end see it's hitting is hitting the rubber ring uh, you know I try to investigate and I think this is worth it for $69.99 the $20 unfortunately I can find any cheaper to send this for um, the only I mean this $20 and if you if you guys buy something close to my place like Colorado or Arizona I maybe adjust and I let you know with the mail if this could be less than twenty dollars but uh, this is a really nice piece and I have two I gonna use the same video for the other one but I wanna take pictures for the each one so the picture is gonna be the origin the piece you are buying well, uh, $69.99, $20 shipping. And uh, thank you for watching. I will take some pictures. And uh, this is a nice, you have a square surface. You can mount in here your table with the other one and make a nice. You have a lot of trouble. It depends on the size of the table you want to build. But it's 40 and a half inches in the uh, the rod not the trouble the rod the trouble we maybe discount two and a half and two and a half five inches so we're talking about about 35 36 inches of trouble I'm not guarantee the pending so thank you for watching and I will work in the other one but I will use the same video thanks again